All right, let's uh, uh, take on our second story. You know, in our country, the head of the judicial arm of government is the chief justice, who must be the most senior member of the bench at the apex court. President Bola Tinubu has sworn in Justice Kudirat Kekereku as the 23rd Chief Justice of Nigeria's CJN. This unique development follows the retirement of the 22nd Chief Law Officer of the country, Justice Ulukayo de Ariwala, who has clocked the mandatory 70-year threshold for a CJN. Mr. President has congratulated Mr. Justice Ariwala for a successful tour of duty, and Justice Kekereku would be the second female CJN after Miriam Aloma Mukhtar, who served between 2012 and 2014, Charles. Yes, um, it's good. Uh, but uh, again, I look at her age, she's 66. Um, yeah. The mandatory retirement year is 70. So mm -hmm. she has just four years to give us what she has to do. But again, some of who have followed her for a long time, for some time. I think in 1996, when she became the chief judge of Lagos State, and then about two years after, if I'm not going on, a year after that, when she became the chairman of the firearms tribunal, during uh, uh, Marwa, Boba Marwa, she did quite a lot. And that's why that she was able to etch her name mm -hmm. uh, in the annals of the uh, of, uh, uh, in Nigeria. So uh, uh, we are having them. But again, uh, as a woman, the one in 2012, 2014, I, I don't think any, many people can remember those years of that woman, what she actually did, you know. Uh, I can't, I've, I've searched through the histories. I didn't actually see any outstanding thing about that Aloma uh, Mutarova. But again, we are seeing this one coming in. Let's begin to see very I mean, flash moves, just like uh, when, you, when you bring somebody from the bench uh, as, as a footballer, you begin to see moves yeah. that will change the game. And also, that's what I, I expect to see uh, in the days to come. Many human beings, including all three yes. of us here, are either introverts or extro extroverts. So, well, uh, in, in Trova, they, they, have, they have a role to play in the leadership in the judiciary no, as well? No, I'm, I'm just telling you what is. Oh, okay. Uh, BKO, so um, you expect... Um, uh, something different. Yeah, everyone uh, comes into office with a set of goals. Mm -hmm. um, Justice Ariwala talked about the fact that the Supreme Court has been overburdened with so many cases. That was um, in his uh, parting shots, and I agree. So mm -hmm. the cases that get all the way to Supreme Court shouldn't really get to support. Yeah, that's right. Especially this uh, letter, uh, election-based litigation yeah, and all that. Yeah. A lot of them shouldn't get to uh, the Supreme Court. They are, we have to find the alternative means of conflict resolution to ensure that not all cases even go to court. Yeah. You know, yeah. that is one. And um, Ariwola, you have to give him credit because for the first time now, the Supreme Court in, in a long time, the Supreme Court has its full complement of justice. Justices. Mm. Yeah. Uh, this was something that happened mm. during his time and during President Inubu's time. Mm. So, a situation in which um, some states will complain that they are not represented, that has been taken care of. <laughs> some uh, geopolitical zones, zones yeah. they are not adequately represented. See, For example, the Southeast matters. was not. Uh, adequately represented after the deaths of some other uh, judges, the judges from there, that has been sorted out now. So, in terms of the effic efficiency and running the Supreme Court, mm. this is a, a much younger person than uh, Muhammad Tanku, for example, who was ill and um, uh, his colleagues in the Supreme Court were even complaining and a petition, in fact, leaked which hastened his departure from the position. Yeah, okay, so, I remember. Kekere um, Akun yeah. is uh, fairly young, and uh, she has the opportunity to stay for at least four years uh, on the side, which is good. Um, she will be able to implement her reforms, and her role is even beyond the Supreme Court. Hmm. As the head of the NJC, for example, okay, there is a lot that yeah, you can do to, in to terms of uh, tweak. Mm -hmm. yes, regulating mm -hmm. the practice. I mean, uh, legal practice, uh, instilling discipline, discipline. Mm -hmm. judges mm -hmm. and all that. So, this is an area that she has to and, focus. And on. telling the common man uh, that the court yes. still the, remains the last hope. The the 
idea of giving complete of conflicting judge, um, judgments is an embarrassment. A coordinative, I mean, yeah, yeah, coordinate, 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 uh, coordinate judges. Mm. Um, mm. Forum shopping, whereby people know that look, they don't have um, uh, locus, uh, locus, mm. but. Lawyers Let's just try it out. Lawyers who still Step push uh, we'll exactly to file, exactly file, file uh, cases and then uh, some judges who agree to uh, sit on those matters. Yeah. These are issues that we will expect this, uh, the new CGN to really deal with. And the, the NJC should expedite the dispensation of justice, justice discipline. Yeah, because it can. Petitions come to them, but it takes it usually takes a long time yeah. before they decide. Yeah. And also, and uh, that leaves so much room mm. for wayward judges mm. to continue to, to take advantage, to take advantage of that advantage. And, and, and destroy uh, the judiciary. The credibility so of, uh, the, I, I have uh, high hopes, and following her from her days in Lagos, you know, she, she handled the uh, Al Mustafa's yes, murder yes, case, yes, yes, you know, okay. uh, murder of. Uh, Kudira, Kudira yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, involving the trial of General uh, Bameyi, mm -hmm. CSP Rabo Lawal, um, ex uh, um, um, staff of uh, the woman, that's Latif Shofolahan, you know, and then uh, Anajemba, yeah. remember Anajemba, the woman who was accused of uh, advanced fee fraud, that big woman. She also handled so she handled some big cases here in Lagos before she was uh, promoted to the appeal court and then she ended up uh, the Supreme Court. So she had a stellar career, and I, I want to believe that um, um, she will do her best as CJ. Yeah, she has ah. a full complement, and there are some fantastic judges in that Supreme yeah. Court. No? She, she, she has a credible team. Very solid judges now mm. on that, uh, 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 among those Supreme Court judges. Justice Agim, former mm. chief judge of Gambia. Okay. She's still, she, okay. she's still uh, very much in the Supreme Court. We have uh, Okoro. Okoro, mm. too, is I, next I, to her. I, 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 Okoro. I, I, Okoro is yeah. next to her. Been there. You know, Okoro has experience. He's mm. it's been... Uh, and, and his name is always, always in the news for all mm. these mm. very they give, powerful judgments. They usually mm. uh, make him head yes. a lot of the big cases. That's it. That's because okay. of his experience. Mm. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. There before. So it's, all, it's always in the news. They may not be the one to read the judgment. Yes. Agim, for example, it. Agim, Agim is very so, good so, at reading. Exactly. Yeah. Agim uh, will read some yeah, of those judgments. Mm. You know? So those, but, those two, they are, they are always in the news. Yes. Yeah, when they have big uh, cases uh, and all they that. Have, uh, yes. uh, the, yes. uh, the Supreme Court is in a good place yeah, now. With it. All it. of it. those people. Mm. Be, 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 Charles, yes. you, you know, her rising, that's uh, Justice Kiki Rekun's yeah. rising, reminds me of what the late Baroness Thatcher said. She said, if you want anything said, Ask a man, but if you want anything done, ask a woman. Uh, well, uh, so both both yeah, men and women. Both men and women. But, I, yes. but there, there have been instances in Nigeria, women who have uh, had a position of leadership, mm. we, that, that can stand. But again, who stands out in this? Because again, as I basic said... Basic women. Or she not... Basic, basic, basic women uh -huh. of, 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 uh, of uh, in that infamous uh, ABM. Yes, in, in so that, association of uh, better Nigeria. All those quotations. All those quotations. They, <laughs> they, they, they don't... Have, <laughs> remember, uh, basic women who were... Who, uh, uh, midnight. Yes, midnight, uh, midnight, uh, uh, yes. Not be women. Come on. Where we hear stories. But the only thing... Another thing is that... Imagine the Kekereku shares... Just bear it with me. How about that? Uh -huh. May 7, May 7. But you May are 7. not in... No, we are, are May 7. No, both May 7. But, but you are a journalist. And uh, not, no, I said she has bear day. That's what I'm I now I understand. understand. I, I know what you need to talk. And it's good to share. <laughs> <laughs> it's good to share. <laughs> <laughs> we, 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 congratulations to her. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, congrats. Yeah, we, we, Welcome we, on so board, man. Not everyone can get to no, that. No, no, to that, to that. Yeah. Yeah. A woman yeah. for that matter. Yeah, for that matter. So it's a good thing. A woman heads the Court of Appeal. Mm-hmm. A woman heads the Supreme Court. Okay. So the biggest courts in our land are headed by women, by women. at this time. So the women are So let, let's, yeah. let's see what they're going to be bringing to the table to, to, to change the whole thing and see if there will be a semblance of people believing that indeed justice and judgment can also uh, come without purchasing anything at all. Charles, yes. better, days, better days are in the offing. I hope they come very, 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 very,